guys, welcome to Archland and happy Valentine's Day to everyone. Um, not sure if it's Valentine's Day already in your time zone, but regardless, it's February 14 now, and this update is going to be dropping tomorrow at February 15. So this is going to be a long update, guys. It's a massive update. So first, we have um, two of the most OP units and uh, heroes to drop namely um gin and marguerite this maintenance is going to happen um between 9 to 1300 which is roughly i think morning in my time zone um this is a long update guys this is a four hour update so be sure that you are on standby for any um when the server is actually up and by the way if you miss this maintenance reward is five heavens key okay that's that's a lot that's a lot that's uh five free summons and a premium sandwich which is an ssr so check out the virus contents in the update here first we have an uh, as i've said a banner for marguerite we have here the banner for marguerite uh, Queen of Iris, uh, both of them are going to be up. And both of their duration is the same. So Marguerite, again, just want to repeat, this is a light mage um, slash slash priest. She is a, she's a hybrid. And uh, her we weapon type is going to be a magic one. So take note of that. She is a very, very good mage, guys. If you've uh, seen, if you haven't seen my um, skill preview for them, please check that out. Tomorrow, I will be having a very in-depth assessment or um, it's more of a recommendation video, breaking down their skills and probably helping you decide it's not the decision won't be on if you'll get them or not um both of them are good you should get either of them or both of them but the video would be on which would be suited for you at that point or at this point in your roster okay so you might have different needs so i'll be taking you through that i'll be evaluating each of their kits so again this is marguerite this is Jin. For, um, again, for, for Marguerite, she's a mage, blah, blah, blah. I mentioned that a while ago. <coughs> Sorry about that. So, we have here Jin. So, Jin is, um, oh, by the way, Marguerite, Marguerite is going to be um, uh, light. And that is wonderful for a mage. Going back again to Jin. I'm so, actually, I'm, I'm tired. I, I did a lot of swimming today. So... More or less, um, I was, I just want to segue a bit. I was away for a family trip out of town. Did some swimming <coughs> for Valentine's Day. So I'm back tonight. So Jin here is, um, attribute is water. Occupation is going to be warrior. So similar to Charlotte. So if you have two of them, then you'll be very, very, uh, people will have a headache dealing with you in PvP seriously um weapon uh, type is a one-handed sword more or less it's the same rapier as um uh, as uh charlotte so they're going to he can actually use a rapier i think so he also has a very very nice kit uh, again if you've seen the skill preview please take a look at that he has first attack so that is Again, a very, very good skill to have. I'll Again, I'll have a skill preview tomorrow, a review of everything and recommendation whether you should pref whether you should get Jin or you should get uh, Marguerite. Again, both of them are a must-pull, either or both. But again, if you are going to select, I'll help you select that tomorrow on which you will be prioritizing. So for, the, for these two, I'm going to put out a summon video, skill review, I'm really excited to you know to showcase both of them. So also, um, new main story, main episode. So you have uh, these are new chapters. Okay, chapters twenty three to uh, twenty six to thirty two in the main episode are open. 
So for those of you who are stuck already in the story and haven't progressed forward, these are new chapters for you to progress further. Okay, new content. This is going to be under Magic Vortex Stage 60 plus grade difficulty. This is a new difficulty level. For those who are level 60 already, then this is the one for you guys. Sadly, I'm still at level 54, so still a lot of catching up to do. Okay, so Promised Land Oath opening. This is a Charlotte Pledge update as well. Promised Land... Um, Music Hall opening time. So this one. So this, I think, is a bunch of songs uh, reopened in the hall. Magic Whirlpool reward added, courtesy of Explorers. So you'll be saving uh, two additional rewards per day. This is the usual you've seen this, guys. And we have uh, shop items. This is under Perry. Um, support package of divine protection. I'll talk about this tomorrow and see how they're worth. Um, I have to do the computations um, by tomorrow. And this is up until this part here. So this the sales period will be up until February 19. Some of them are on the 21st. Okay. So bug fixes. A lot of bug fixes, guys. Optimization, bounty market, gold supply and demand improvement, unexpected encounter, improved gold supply and suppression of rebellion stage. In-game screen acceleration function is added. In-game screen acceleration function. You can adjust it through settings and preference in the game. Hmm, this is actually interesting. Screen acceleration function. It's interesting, but I don't understand it at this point. The animation playback speed of the equipment reach max level function and guild cooperation acceleration function is increased as well. This one I'll have to check as well. But there are a lot of optimizations here. In the screen where the unexpected encounter and reward of the Gong A uh, mercenary core are displayed, an indicator will be added for randomly obtained rewards. In the memoir, um, description of the acquisition path of knowledge is added. And number seven, when a hero costume is installed, the profile image of the strongest hero ex exposed in the rankings will appear wearing the costume. Uh, okay. Um, Oshiwa, Ush strawberry, and black spore flowers have been added to the garden of the promised land. Nice. You see the brief information of about the products currently on display on the staff when assigned to a direct grocery store. Okay. You can see the current inventory of goods and direct. Okay. And the order of heroes displayed in the staff is optimized with adjusting personnel of magic workshop hero suitable for the factory with the displayed first. Okay, what this uh, needs is also to display the count for the summons. Again, I've been asking that for the devs to include that as well. So if you've summoned 10, so 10 out of 90 because the pity comes at 90. Again, this is important, guys, because people are going to look to this as a goal when they summon. So that is actually, I think, the most immediate part. Um, and also, the refresh of the energy or the bread should also have a counter, a time counter. Wh whenever I know it's every five minutes that it refreshes one, but again, it should have a count. Uh, it should have a counter. So that is, I think, um, next part of the optimization. Hopefully, so bug fixes. Um, I won't go into the bug fixes. These um, should be fixed. <laughs> Improved localization, correct path where active was written. Okay, penetration. Okay, so and fix some typos in the game and improve readability. Okay, so range, range unified. The lighthouse, uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so there we go. So, so far, a lot of... Um, improvements in the game which will make it kind of better but the devs need to, to consider that the important optimization should be prioritized first based on what um, the player base needs based on what is really important to all or not most of the players so that is it guys so hopefully I could see you tomorrow again um, please do stand by for the summoning video. I plan to summon for both tomorrow. So hopefully um, 
um, RNG gods are in my, you know, in my corner tomorrow. And I could summon for both. I have enough for one pity. I'm sure I'm at 90 plus for Heaven's Key. But I need, if, if, hopefully I don't go to pity because I could jump towards the second summon banner um when i do my summons tomorrow so again guys best of luck to all of you and this is going to be a very exciting update because both of them are going to be game changers in your roster so please make sure that you make the right decision and also please make sure to watch my video tomorrow for an assessment of both whether you should prioritize gin or marguerite so, again, guys, thank you very much for staying this far. Happy Valentine's again. Take care. Stay safe. This is The Warden, and I'm out of here.